Hey guys, I'm back. Um, uh, this is my last subscription uh, month to Shades Club. It was the last month of a four month subscription that I bought to just try it out and see how good it is. Um, so I wanted to do the last unboxing and kind of talk about if it was worth it and all the shades that they sent. Uh, so here is the last box. I just wanted to do oh, I gotta go get scissors. Okay, I'll be back. All right, I'm back. And the box is open now. Okay, so let's see what they sent this month. It says the Jet Setter. And let's see what it is. Oh, those are nice. Okay, so they are very reflective too, as you can see. Alright, so I guess I'll try these on real quick and see if I like them. <laughs> you have to excuse my uh, lack of makeup today. I just wanted to get this video done uh, while I had some quiet in the house. So yeah, these are nice. I like them. I mean, they're kind of huge, but they're cute. and. They seem like the style that everyone's wearing. And they reflect, so you could probably like take some cool Instagram pictures or something. I don't know. Anyway, there they are. And now I can see my dirty table that's in front of me. Okay, so I want to talk about Shades Club real quick. Um, I like doing this. The four months were great, and there was only one pair that I really didn't like, which probably they weren't even really that bad. It's just not really my style, and I thought it looked kind of funny on my face. Um, but whatever. Then, so the four months are good. I, I liked three of them a lot, and I use them a lot. Um, I don't think I need more sunglasses than that. The problem is that I did the four months subscription, and then they, I got this email, like, after I got my last month, and I said, thank you for your purchase, a four month subscription. And they charged me like $112. I was like, I didn't purchase another one. So I contacted them and I said, okay, what, what is this? I didn't do another subscription, another four month subscription. And they said, um, I guess it like auto does it if you don't cancel it, which is the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> Cause you get other subscriptions and they say, would you like to do it again? Would you like to do it again? They keep sending you emails. You have to say yes, it's not like, Oh, thanks. Here's, you know, we're just going to charge you $112 and send you four more pairs after we sent your four month subscription. So I said, you need to remove this. I'm going to contact my credit card company. And they said something about how they were, thank you for your review on YouTube and it helped us out. So we're going to help you out. So we'll only send you one pair and we'll charge you for it. <laughs> I was so mad. So, I mean, Whatever. I contact my uh, contacted my credit card company, and I'm pretty sure they'll figure it out, because that's just the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. So if you're gonna do this, make sure if you do like a four month subscription or whatever amount of time, make sure you cancel it after that amount of time. And if you're the type of person who doesn't remember to do that, then I would not recommend this to you. <laughs> um, I mean, maybe they'll change that after my dispute with my credit card company, but I don't know. I was just was like the silliest thing ever. I mean, you get magazine subscriptions for like a year and they're not going to just keep sending you magazines for the rest of your life <laughs> or, you know, like, unless you cancel. It's just the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. So yeah, that was my, my, uh, downside of this whole thing, but I'm sure we have USA and they, they're pretty good at figuring these things out for you, so I don't think that they'll charge me for it or send me another pair of sunglasses, and I don't think I'll do this ever again. Um, I think there's some websites out there of cheaper sunglasses. You can just buy what you want. Um, like the first one, it was uh, Dick's Cotton, and I looked at their website, and you can just get like cheaper sunglasses, which is probably where they get theirs from. They probably just buy like a stock of them for even cheaper and then they sell them so um, 
yeah, I don't know what the other ones are, but I guess one says so the Jet Setter. I don't know if that's the brand, because the sunglasses doesn't actually say, but if I find out, I'll put it below <laughs> for all these brands. And uh, after I go outside and get the other pair, I'll show you all four of them. And yeah, so here are all the glasses that I got with this four month subscription. Um, yeah, like I said before, I liked all of them except for this one. Um, and I think it's just kind of a weird shape for my face. Um, this one is cool, but I don't know if it's one I would normally buy at the store, but I'll still probably wear it. So anyway, there they all are. Um, if I figure out what brand they are, I will put that in the description below. That's the end of this unboxing of four months, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Alright, oh, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. Thank you. Okay, bye.